Hello everyone, Andrew here, and today I want to talk about Super Mario Galaxy, soon to be re-released along with the Super Mario 3D All-Stars collection. It's incredible to believe that this was released back on November 12th, 2007, almost 13 years ago, and it really was released around the height of the Wii, I think. But what I really want to focus on in this video is back in the day, if you pre-ordered this, you didn't have to do anything else special, no kind of you know special edition purchase or anything like that. Back in the day, there was cases where if you just pre-order the game, you would get a special bonus with it. And in this case, you got a commemorative coin. So now 13 years later with the re-release of this game, I thought it'd be fun to have a little bit of a look at just what you would have got back in the day had you pre-ordered it, as you see down there, free commemorative launch coin with reservation of Super Mario Galaxy. So, you know, no extra $50 special edition massive package or anything like that. They actually used to give away physical things for free. It's incredible to think about that. One of the things I've noticed on the back, that upper left screenshot actually uses the beta life counter, which has eight segments rather than three. So it's more like the Mario 64 and Mario Galaxy one. I think it's kind of a shame that they changed that. I like the, the bigger life counter, but uh, different attacks will take off different amounts of damage. I thought it was kind of kind of too simple just being reduced to three, which would then of course be carried over to Super Mario Odyssey. And our friend Mario is bound for outer space. Man, I remember the hype around this game when it came out back in the day. It was awesome. It was uh, awarded all sorts of Game of the Year awards and such. Very cool. But let us pull out the side of this here. And as you can see, this is kind of just a cardboard sleeve, which inside houses another cardboard sleeve with a really nice kind of picture Super Mario Galaxy. I also like how the fronts of the two things are kind of the same picture, but they for some reason take all the background detail out of the coin one. Uh, the Overall, the art for Mario Galaxy was always very nice. And this is again, just another cardboard sleeve that says we on the back. And when we flip this open, we get a certificate of authenticity. It says, commemorative launch coin. This official collectible item has been, has been produced exclusively by Nintendo of America Inc. to commemorate the launch of Super Mario Galaxy. So that's pretty cool. And then here we go. Mario is on an out of this world. It's out of this world in Super Mario Galaxy only on the Wii. I love how they pretty much found like five ways to say the exact same thing. But then what we're really worried about is on the right here is that commemorative launch coin in a nice uh, Luma shaped kind of slot here. So you can pull that out nice and gently. And just like that, it says Super Mario Galaxy on the back. And you got a really nice picture of a Mario and Luma on the front. So I can push that back in here and push it down. And it should stick nicely again. And there you go. So I just wanted to show this because I figured, you know, a lot of people buying the 3D collection these days probably hadn't ever seen this item before. So it kind of gives you a taste of what it might have been like had you pre-ordered the original game back today. I do hear that the 3D All-Stars version is kind of sold out everywhere right now, or rather it's not out yet, but the pre-orders are kind of all exhausted, so hopefully anyone who wants the game has had the chance to get their hands on a physical pre-order. Uh, and yeah, I just thought that this was pretty neat. One more thing I should mention is that if you think this item is interesting, I actually did look it up before making this video, and it looks like you can find this commemorative coin online for about 10 to $20, so it's actually not that expensive considering it's something that you probably won't see around too often anymore. So if you wanted to you know, have the experience of pretending you had pre-ordered Mario Galaxy back in the day, when you get your 3D All-Stars copy of it, you could go online, buy this for not too much, and it's just a really neat item. I mean, Nintendo's released other commemorative coins as well, like there was a Smash Brothers one, and a Year of Luigi one. Who can say no to a commemorative coin? It's much better to get a physical pre-order item than, you know, uh, here's a download code for 50 extra lives or something like that. Man, those were the days. Definitely uh, the end of, like, an epic generation of gaming where there was physical objects and there was actually instruction manuals. Ugh, those are the days. But thanks for watching this. Hope you enjoyed and hope you have an absolutely excellent time with Super Mario 3D All-Stars tomorrow. So thanks and see you later. Thank you so much once again for checking out my videos. I really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed, please consider leaving a like and subscribing as it really helps my channel out. With that said, hope to see you next time.